for this week's video, I decided to do my everyday carry. So I've been carrying this stuff since about the middle of 2022. So I'm calling it a 2023, but it's just the beginning. So first thing is the Leatherman Surge in the REA gear holster. So I've done a video on this. So this pretty much stays with me all the time. Super handy. Next thing that I always have is um, this is just um, iPhone 12 mini in the green. It's in um, the Apple leather case. And then I have the, uh, the MagSafe wallet, which some people complain that the wallet falls off, but I've never had it. I've never had it fall off or anything, even without the case, just sticking right to the glass. So it works fine for me, but it is, if it's on the mini, it's like exactly the perfect size. So that might be why if you have a bigger um, phone, it might not stay as easy. And then I just keep my debit card or my ID in here. It's the only two cards I really ever need. Um, and then next thing is um, Apple AirPods. These are the third generation AirPods. These are not the Pros. I don't like the little rubber tip for the Pros. That's why I got these. Um, although I do like the shape of the one and two AirPods case better, the one that opens this um, on the top like that. I don't know, just this case seems a little weird, but these are way more comfortable. So it's kind of something you just got to get used to. Those are always with me. These are my um, sunglasses that I have. I've had these for about two years now. There's some Ray-Bans. I found them. They were in the the clearance section on their website. I looked, and they um, they are still on the website in the clearance section. So one thing I noticed is this little button, like, it broke like with within a month of getting it. So I, I don't know if just the case is kind of cheap or what. But everything else seems to hold up fine. Just that little button broke. And they're just black and they got the little cloth. So I really like these ones a lot. I'm not exactly sure how much these are, but they weren't they weren't terribly expensive. Um, and then this beard comb. I'm actually not exactly sure where I got this, but I did find uh, find one on Amazon that looks very similar. So I will put links to everything down below. Um, I think this is like bamboo or something, but it's small. That's why I like that one. And then this is the Fisher Space Pen. So these can get kind of expensive, but what I like about them is they're all metal. And then they're pretty small when they are fold. They fold up, but then it opens up and then you can put the cap on and then it's like a full-size pen, which makes it really, really nice. And these are the ones with the the ink cartridges are pressurized so you can write like upside down or or um, I think you can even write underwater I, I've never tried that but you can write like upside down or different angles and stuff so these are really handy to have and they're small and then this is uh, the Streamlight micro stream it it's just a single AAA uh, flashlight it's like the perfect the perfect size it just holds one single AAA it's about the same size as the pen and it's nice because like everyone has like flashlights on their phone but this is an actual like really bright light and you can see so I always carry this because it's so much better than using your phone and then I actually had another one of these and then the battery like it, I don't know if it exploded but it corroded so I definitely bought another one just because they're so handy and then this is my Groove Life belt. So I was kind of skeptical about this because this thing was like 75 bucks. But I've had this for two years now. You can see it's kind of wearing a little bit. And it's it's really honestly like one of the best belts I've ever had. I just keep the rubber band around it just because it'll like, it'll, it won't stay in this shape. It's like a canvas belt. So it's got a little bit of stretch to it, which is really nice. And you can loosen it a little bit if you have to or tighten it. I'm going to do a video on this at some point. It's just I haven't yet. And then the latches are magnetic and everything. The only thing I don't like about it is the extra um, like the extra belt is retained by this little like it's elastic but it just this thing doesn't ever stay where you need it to stay and it like it falls off. I found this thing on the ground before so it's like for as expensive as the belt is, they should have a better way to retain the extra. 
And then one of the last things, this isn't like an every, every day thing, but most days, it's just a cup. This one's the Stanley one. So I was looking on their website and they don't make this color anymore. This is like the, like the old green one, like the old coffee cups or thermoses, but they still make the same cup. It's the 2.0. This is like the 1.0. They make a bunch of different colors, black, gray, white, I think, and then there's a different green. But one thing I really liked about this cup over the other ones, a couple things, is one is it's got the, the hole for the straw, so you can turn it, and then you can, like, if you don't want to use the straw, you can, like, drink out of it like that. I probably should, it needs to be washed a little bit. Um, or the straw is retained like that. And then one thing, too, is it's is the lid screws on. Most of them, the lids don't screw on. So that's one of the reasons I got it. This cup was only like 20 bucks on eBay. They were not that expensive. And then I keep everything in this little tray. I think it was like a cheese tray or a cheese board tray or something I found on Amazon. But I'll link it down below. And this is the medium. They make, they make a small and they make a large. And then this is the medium. And everything just kind of fits. It's, what do they call it? Like a dump tray. When I come home, I just kind of throw everything on here and... It makes it nice to keep everything in one spot and handled. So I'll put links to everything uh, that I found or that are close to what it is. Um, some of them are Amazon links. Some of them are links from the specific manufacturers.